Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry about the miss in the last few weeks. I've been busy with work situations, but hey, now I am back. There are various things I want to catch up with you these days, but instead of me talking to the camera, sharing over food and life is my next comfortable way. It's been a while since I do vlog as well, so I want to bring you to a typical weekend of mine. Start with my favorite Vietnamese restaurants in southwest London. This place is called Boy Vien on Wandsworth Road, around 15 minutes away from where I live. I've always enjoyed exploring neighborhood restaurants when moving to a new area, and pho has been my recent love. We ordered a prawn papaya salad, rare beef pho, and a stir fry morning glory with beef. My boyfriend and I chat on small meals like this, and when we talk about our 20s, anxiety seems to be the constant theme throughout. Career, body, financial, social. It comes from a scroll from social media, a convo with a friend who seems passionate and super driven. A meal with families tells you about the kids next door. This comparison, competition, perfectionism loop in our head drives us to want to achieve, action, achieve, feeling not achieve enough, so on and so forth. Living in a city has intensified this loop. We were constantly placed against those benchmarks. We feel like failures comparing to our peers, or those ones younger than us made their dream position at the age of 25. But hey, everyone you will ever meet knows something you don't, and everyone has their own struggles at their various stages. It is a game of our own, not the man computer game mode that you can play chances to win. At least that's what I've been telling myself throughout my 20s. There is no real joy coming from comparing yourself with others, and it is okay to take it slow, and it is okay to still trying to figure it out. And these words worked for me alongside many sips of good soups. While well, thoughts are not the only thing you can burn in the city, I start to go to berries from time to time these days. The music and lighting really lift my adrenaline. The studios are mostly set up on lower ground floors in London, and with the atmosphere created, exercising feels like a cult activity, and I secretly enjoy it. I normally go to the full body classes. It works particularly well for me when I want to restart my fitness routine. And after a good 60-minute sweat, I felt lighter in both mind and body, which I really enjoy. If you had some foundation exercise, I would highly recommend. On Sundays, I normally spend time with myself, wandering around. Visiting a new cafe, have some hot coffee, and grab a sweet pastry. I don't know if you are the same, but the longer I live in London, the more I enjoy doing these things by myself. I still enjoy meeting up with my friends, but visiting these places and doing these things by myself is like a meditation. With the crowd noises as a backdrop, you can kind of immerse in your own world without getting disturbed whilst walking the crowd. My favorite bakery in central London now are Meals at Warren Street, a Rome at Covent Garden, and 42 Bakehouse at Russell Square. They all have creative flavors coming out from time to time, and you can just get that balance of wanting to try something new and stick to my old choices from one place. And they have good coffees as well. And all these get me ready for the new week. <laughs> See you next time. Hi.